Namaste. This is uh, Vivek Anand. You can call me Vivek. And uh, here we are today collaborating. Uh, so with uh, David. David? This is Small Biz David, and you can call me Small Biz David. <laughs> <laughs> that, that works. It works. That's what Google calls me. So you can call me that. <laughs> <laughs> I have heard people, uh, technology people say, why should we bother about marketers? Marketing is someone else's job. Why should we care? Or they hire a marketer and uh, pay them what they think is reasonable and expect things to work. It doesn't happen that way. So the question I would like to answer is why should a technology person like myself collaborate with marketers? As a technology person, I tend to be technical and often that uh, becomes um, brutally honest, which <laughs> People are you, probably are you trying to say marketers aren't brutally honest, Vivek? <laughs> marketers are honest, but they can see the positive side more often than uh, technology geeks like me. I tend to see because, uh, in my view, the biggest problems have to be sorted out first. And then we solve the finer uh, aspects. So from technology point of view, technology is often the most difficult thing to sort out. So and uh, if someone asks me a question, I would probably go deep into the technology uh, behind it uh, that surrounds it. and. Uh, get deep into technological discussion, which probably would put off <laughs> any prospective clients. So that's a basic fundamental reason why a technology person like me has to have a collaboration with marketer. So what what's uh, your view? Why? why uh, why do you think a marketer should talk to technology person, David? You created a very interesting analogy uh, between technology and marketing. Um, marketing tells the story. Mm. Technology builds uh, the infrastructure, if you will. Mm. So there, there's a natural reason for the, the, the two to collaborate with one another, number one, just conceptually speaking. But from the real aspect of uh, a small business, once the small business owner defines their purpose, mm. why, why are they doing what they're doing, that small business uh, is uh, marketing, sales, and the technology that you employ to support your marketing and sales effort. Uh, to that point, I have found, as you well know, I am not a technology geek. <laughs> I know how to do what I know how to do. I know how to do what I, I need to know how to do. But uh, that's why I turn to somebody like yourself who can dig deeper, who, who understands uh, why you need to dig deeper to execute a specific uh, uh, aspect of, 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 of your small business. Uh, Vivek, when I started in business uh, over 40 years ago, uh, technology was not that important, quite honestly. Mm. We did things in very, very manually uh, back in the early days, uh, which mm. included getting on a telephone and <laughs> soliciting somebody for their business. I mean, there was a lot of that being done, but today we, we live in a different world. You, you still can employ uh, some very basic things from years ago, but you have, to, you have to be in tune to what's happening today. We have to know where our customers reside. Where are they? 
What, what are they doing? How do we contact them? That's the challenge of marketing. Now, how many times have I come to you with marketing challenges and you said, okay, David, here's my recommendation for the technology to support that. Mm. Uh, and I can say, bottom line, you changed the way you, Vivek changed the way that I do business, uh, what, probably about a year ago, or is it, is it a little over a year now, that mm -hmm. uh, you said, David, you need to do this, this, and this, and I listened to you with your expertise, and here we are today. Uh, David, you and myself, we, we run different uh, setups. We have our own uh, startup setup. Um, neither of us is a huge, big uh, conglomerate, uh, corporate house, no. Uh, <laughs> oh, you don't know uh, what I have going in the background, Vivek. <laughs> you only see me. You don't know what I have going in the background. <laughs> Oh uh, no, that is a that is an accurate statement to make. Yes, <laughs> same same goes to you as well. Uh, but the point was, if there is no collaboration, if you hire a technology person to do a specific job and there is no collaboration, then what happens is when you come to me asking for some advice, the advice that I would be giving would be to continue hiring me. <laughs> it, 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 in such a case, the advice given to you will not really be what you actually need. It would be what suits me more than what it suits you. That's, uh -oh. that's the honest so fact. Why, so why should we hire the Indians and avoid the cowboys? <laughs> ah. <laughs> That's where the collaboration comes in. When, when there is a collaboration, um, it, there is a great chance that uh, I, I'm not so much concerned about continued business from you uh, because it's a collaboration. So that means I would give you the honest advice which is good for you rather than um, it may be good for me as well, but it would be better for you. So that's one of the reasons why marketer and technology person need to um, collaborate. Wow, and the, uh, and the way that our collaboration has worked, you know, I am constantly thinking about your marketing. You know that. I bring up ideas uh, to you all the time. Mm -hmm. As well, and you're you're always on me uh, uh, for my technology, uh, be it uh, hardware, be it software, uh, whatever it might be, mm -hmm. uh, because you know that the way that I do business, your solution is best for me. The way that I do business, as you well know, is <laughs> you know it's it's totally my own way of doing things, and that's it works for me. Hmm. It works for me. My business model works for me. But you're going to, we, we both run into, you know, people that have dramatically different business models than we do. So we mm -hmm. have to understand uh, what that model is. Uh, you have to understand what you do, uh, the technology that will support that particular business model. And, uh, yeah, marketing, there, there's some very basic things about marketing, but, uh, uh, there's also some very unique, specific things that each business must explore, must understand, and must be able to communicate uh, to the marketplace uh, about their business. So I'm going to make a suggestion, uh, Vivek, that you know, you and I have been working together for uh, going on two years now. Mm -hmm. What I would like to um, uh, propose to take our collaboration to mm -hmm. the next level Mm -hmm. uh, would be that uh, you've assisted me, I've assisted you uh, in, in ways that we can assist each other to make our businesses move forward. Why don't we create an audit mm -hmm. where uh, you ask your seven critical questions, I mm -hmm. ask my seven critical questions, we offer it to the marketplace, and anybody that takes the time to fill out the form that is right underneath the, the video here, 
uh, or will be underneath the video. Anybody that takes the time, you and I will provide a, an audit based upon the answers that they give us to the questions. Is that, mm -hmm. is, that a, is that a good way to move this collaboration forward? Yes, and that that uh, you you bring up the uh, you have uh, uh, answered the third point there. How would a collaboration work? Uh, um, there are many aspects. One is uh, we interact using a video uh, call like this. We create a document which uh, both of us can see at the same time even though we are separated geographically by quite a few time zones. <laughs> Five uh, to be we, exact. <laughs> <laughs> we, we collaborate on documents. We uh, even uh, collaborate on uh, slide shows. Um, we even collaborate creating mind maps even creating videos uh, so that that's the technology side of collaboration how about the human side well the human side is very simple folks will fill out the form below uh, and uh, we will you and I will respond from each one of our areas of expertise uh, what our recommendations are for that business so that they can move their business forward. Pretty simple. Pretty simple. Mm -hmm. Integrate. Simplify life. <laughs> Busy businessmen tend to ignore life. So integrate, simplify life. Why don't you and I go see if we uh, have anybody who has filled out our, uh, our audit form yet? <laughs> Let's do that, shall we? <laughs>